On April 8, 2024, the next total solar eclipse will occur. Do you know in which countries can you see it? And why does it happen and what are some amazing facts about the eclipses? Well in today's video we are going to talk about it. Welcome to our channel The Search 2023 Episode 14 Solar Eclipse. Let's start. Eclipses are dramatic celestial events that have fascinated humanity for centuries and capture the imagination of people around the world. Here are some interesting facts about them. There are two main types of eclipses, solar and lunar. A solar eclipse occurs when the moon passes between the earth and the sun, casting a shadow on earth. A lunar eclipse occurs when the earth passes between the sun and the moon, casting a shadow on the moon. Solar eclipses can only occur at new moon, when the sun and moon are aligned as seen from earth. Lunar eclipses can only occur at full moon, when the earth is directly between the sun and moon. The earth and moon are nearly the same apparent size in the sky, which is why we get total solar eclipses. If the moon were much smaller or larger, we would only see partial solar eclipses. Path of totality. The path of totality, the narrow region on Earth where a total solar eclipse can be seen, is only about 100 miles, 160 kilometers, wide. People outside this path will only see a partial eclipse. Totality. During a total solar eclipse, when the moon completely covers the sun, the sky can darken to twilight-like conditions, and stars and planets become visible. This is a rare and awe-inspiring sight for those lucky enough to be within the path of totality. The temperature can drop by several degrees during a total solar eclipse. Diamond ring effect just before and after totality during a total solar eclipse. A brief moment occurs where a bright spot of sunlight shines through a valley on the moon's limb, creating the appearance of a diamond ring around the silhouette of the moon. Eclipses occur in cycles. A Seiros cycle is a period of 18 years, 11 days, and 8 hours. After a Seiros cycle, a similar eclipse will occur at the same location on Earth. Eclipses have been used to predict the future and explain natural phenomena throughout history. In some cultures, they are believed to be bad omens. Bailey's beads. Another phenomenon that occurs just before and after totality is Bailey's beads, where sunlight peaks through the valleys and mountains on the moon's surface, creating a series of bright spots resembling a string of beads. Annular solar eclipses. An annular solar eclipse occurs when the moon is too far away from Earth to completely cover the sun. This results in a ring of sunlight encircling the silhouette of the moon. The longest totality of a solar eclipse in recorded history was 7 minutes and 39 seconds, which occurred in June 1973. Frequency. Solar eclipses are relatively rare events because the alignment of the Sun, Moon, and Earth must be precise for an eclipse to occur. On average, a total solar eclipse is visible from any given location on Earth about once every 375 years. Scientific importance. Eclipses provide scientists with valuable opportunities to study the Sun, Moon, and Earth's atmosphere. During solar eclipses, scientists can observe the Sun's corona, the outermost layer of the Sun's atmosphere, which is usually hidden by the Sun's brightness. Modern observations. Today, eclipses are extensively studied and observed by scientists and enthusiasts alike. Advanced technology such as telescopes, cameras, and satellites allow for detailed observations and measurements during these events. Safety precautions. It's important to observe solar eclipses safely using specially designed solar viewing glasses or other indirect viewing methods to protect your eyes from the sun's harmful rays. 
Looking directly at the sun without proper eye protection can cause permanent damage to your eyesight. The occurrence of eclipses varies over time and location. So it's essential to check specific information for the most accurate details. However, I can provide a general overview of upcoming eclipses. On April 8, 2024 the next total solar eclipse will occur. This eclipse will be visible across parts of Mexico, the United States, and Canada. A little question here, do you know what will happen to a person if he falls from space? That's the topic of our next video so don't forget to like and subscribe to give us your support. If you're interested in seeing this eclipse, you'll need to be within the path of totality. This is a narrow band where the moon completely blocks the sun. The path of totality for the April 8th eclipse will stretch from western Mexico across the United States to eastern Canada. You can find maps of the path of totality online, Eclipse Path Viewer. P.S. The next lunar eclipse will be a partial lunar eclipse, happening on May 16, 2024. This eclipse will be visible from parts of North America, South America, Europe, Africa, and Asia. The visibility of the eclipse will depend on your specific location. To get precise information about the visibility and timing of these eclipses for your location, you can consult astronomical websites, local observatories, or astronomical organizations. Additionally, various apps and software are available that can provide eclipse predictions and visibility information based on your geographical coordinates. We will meet in the next video with a very interesting topic. Bis dann, tschüss.